I'm Cam, and this is Backstage at the Ryman. I think the first time I stepped on the stage of the Ryman was actually during one of the tours. I said, I'm gonna play on this stage one day, and I am doing it. <laughs> I remember I felt this sudden sense of, this place is important. The reason it was built, why it's so acoustically perfect, like the intent behind it, and then the history that's followed, all has made it something special. I was like a little eye of the storm of Nashville. It's very calm, very grounding. Walking backstage at the Ryman, you see a lot of different photos of iconic country stars and people that have made history, like Elvis and Minnie Pearl as the dressing room that I'm in tonight, and Patsy Klein. And then you start to see in the picture, it's them here. It's them on the stage or in these halls and it starts to sink in like, oh my gosh, I'm literally walking where they walked and I'm literally singing where they sang. And it's epic. Like I get goosebumps off stage before I walk on. The band that I play with, I've played with them for a really long time and they're super talented and very, very creative. So we had a good time kind of cooking up a show like this. A lot of times when you're playing shows in Nashville, there's something else attached to it like it's for this purpose. You're doing it along somebody else's terms when you're having your own show, and especially at such a spot like the Ryman, it brings everybody in and you get to set the vibe. I love that it's like a living room feel and it's very close, because you can really, if you want to look at someone and find them in the audience, you can. You can see in their eyes how they're feeling, you can hear them if they decide to holler something at you. How you end up feeling influences me and how I end up feeling influences you. It's a perfect spot to be intimate and to kind of share a moment in music. My parents flew in from California and then I have some special guests showing up too. One of my first musical heroes were the Indigo Girls. I recently got to meet Emily and she's gonna come up and sing with me. I've got Colby Calais, who's just the chillest of chill. And then at the end of the night, Eric Church is gonna come out. He has been a real kind of like cheerleader for me to make me feel like I can really do this and so it's cool to have him show up. I can honestly tell you, this is the most excited I've ever been like in my soul to play a place and it's here at the Ryman. I'm not saying that because you're supposed to say that, I'm saying that because I really feel it. People are gonna cry. 